year. Awesome year. Awesome year. Awesome year. Awesome. Here, glory means God's revelation to his people. It also means that God was in their midst. God scarcely reveals himself to mundane men. In the Bible, God reveals himself to a limited number of people. For example, God revealed himself to Moses in glory on Mount Sinai. God revealed himself to the Son of Man on the top of the Transfiguration Mount in shining glory. It was indeed a great blessing for Israel, Israel that they had the privilege of seeing the glory of God. Those who see only evil people become like those evil people. And live in this world with the fear of living among evil people. On the other hand, those who see the glory of God can have the glory of God in their hearts and live in this world gloriously and victoriously, not fearfully. So it is necessary for us to see the glory of God. We can see the glory of God sometimes through Bible study and prayer. And sometimes through obedience to the will of God. You're awesome. You're awesome. You're awesome. You're awesome. God bless you.